Glass is a very popular operator. You see him come through here again very early into the round as well. 45 seconds in, they've blitzed their way forward and Soldier's been shut down. Side swiped out there by another member of Scar. So one for one so far. So that is the, the roster changes that we have seen recently for them. Um, we're going to have Tayu just moving in there, but it's Rek who's going to pick up the kill. He's going to pick up another one, Des. Takes down the Woogie Man inside a kitchen. And that's going to leave us now in a three versus two as Yas. He manages to find Washoi, and that at least does some work for D-plus here to keep themselves in. Korta could be in a crucial position here, but I think that Scars are aware of his location, Des. They must have the idea because they heard him impact out the two air jabs that were on that doorway inside a small bake earlier on. Now going in for the plant, though, and Tyu's going to be able to finish this one off. They had a good little side swipe there from Pion as well. Hop from Tayu. It's been absolutely fantastic. Yas, it's done and dusted. He must. That's right, just peeking around this corner. Drone goes in. It's as easy as that. What a demonstration of how to work together mm. as a team to get those entry kills. Fishlight showing great presence of mind to go in there and get that opener. Watch Beautiful. Gets a double as well. Taking down Harper yeah, and Woogie Man. And Scars are well on top of round two. It's the bait play off the back of the drones as well. Drones are going in and within a second there's someone straight on top of them looking to capitalise on a kill. And we're sure just find Soldier for free who had no idea what was going on. The only way I could summarise this round is a little bit of blindness coming out from... We don't care about your smokes or your shotguns. We're charging on through with a shield and getting a freebie. Wreck into a second and yet again, d have been absolutely blitzed off it. But Soldier finally steps up the ex-Talon front man coming up in the back line. Yeah, d have actually stood up to this initial rush pretty well. Not maybe immediately. They lost those couple of players as they went in. Um, you know, the blitz opening up. Tayu managing to get the entry kill, but D plus Kia were not rocked by it. They've managed to hold the line and get themselves a man advantage, which is cut back. There's one here looking to cause a little bit of a surprise, and Wushoi has found another. That's two 1v1s that he's managed to isolate, and suddenly we've gone from a 3v2 to a 1 versus 2. Defending continues to be the problem, at least for D plus Kia, then, as they have squandered a 3 versus 2 advantage in terms of man count and now allowed Scars into a position to put that diffuser down again. It happened last time around. In oh, he's got it! Beautiful. Game. Obviously off the back of that clutch in the previous round, but just goes to show how typical Siege can be sometimes that it goes up and down and up and down. One thing going down, though, coated. Wreck is on a killing spree once again. Two in the round, up to five and two in the game. He has not fallen off. Well, Woogie's got a little bit quieter. Wreck carries on. Yeah, Wreck like a, a freight Don't train through cafe. I thought you were going to say a wrecking Fish ball. No, not yet. We'll save that for later. I'm sure there'll be opportunity. Fishlack is going to take down Woogie Man, so his wars continue at the minute. And that leaves a five versus two for Scars. They've absolutely run over this mid-floor site, Des. Fishlack, he moves up the stairs, cut down by Soldier, who oh gets himself God. another. And the fight back is on for Deep. Coming out of laundry there. Uh, but it's Pion who manages to move in and gets the first on to no Yas. Way. It's all up to Soldier. Ooh. Cut down. A lot of yellow pings are coming out when he was sat under the full cams as well. And here comes a run out as well. Here he goes. Straight out the door and finds Bashoi by himself and straight back into safety. Great little play coming out from Yas. That's where they found success. Nade from below. I think might just catch Ooh, Soldier. Beautiful. Yes, it does. Second one. Freebie from coming Rex. out. But now Coates has gone down as well. Two kills coming back in for Scars. And suddenly D plus are on the back foot once again until Yas strikes. Finds two kills from top right. Red, not but it's making a third. That's the Yas we're used to seeing. Goes for the ace as well. Will not find it. Rex still keeping scars in this with 30 seconds to go. Yeah, Yas is going to be kicking it. himself after that. But for he kills, saw his aim in light. He, he did, knew it. He knew he, he grabbed at that one, but just couldn't quite find him. We'll let him off though. Four fantastic kills for Yas to really turn the fortunes oh, boy, around yeah. a little bit for D plus Kia here. But no. I mean, the fact that you're looking at, what, one and eight? You can't have 16 kills oh. across two players. I mean, at this point now, it's, what, two and 14 across three of your players? It's not the dream start you're looking for. That's, again, though, where it's come down to big plays out of Yas and Soldier. Like we said, it has all been on those two players' back so far. Now, obviously, there's other contributions that come in towards that. Wreck is looking for a bit of a backside down red once again, though, and here we go. Finally, Fishlock playing in behind the shield, and they get control of Bakery. That's what they've been looking for. Now they're going to open up site like a sardine tin and start marching their way forwards. To it is going to be a problem. Yes, it uh, is. Yas on the lesion. Woogie Man manages to find one. Nice headshot onto the Wreck. They are aware of Yas' no, position. No, he's going to cut another one down, Des. And that levels things out. 3 3. Now they know that Yas may come from red stairs. Deepest key, you feel like maybe just need to play this 
a little bit more carefully now, but there's going to be an opportunity for this diffuser to go down any second. The hunters have become the hunted here as well. Penned inside of sight. They step around, but Yas again is there. Gets another kill. Finally traded out. We're into a 2v2. With Shoy wins out of the one. Can he win the next? Not quite. But now there's a Monty online and in a two versus one. This round should be all but done outside of a massive screw-up from Scars. Don't throw your life away because you could be an essential backup. We can see there he's going to head outside. No, Woogie Man decides to come back. He's turning left, right. He doesn't really know. <laughs> They want to go for that aggression. They want to fight you all the way through. Coated finding the first one at range, though, on towards Pixel with Shoy. I think he's burnt out half the round there. Not going to feel too beat up by himself. Still tons of thrown utility in the back pockets of D-plus here as well. And I think it was Yasu who hit the deck behind the stage. He took a couple more bullets, but the reduction through the soft surface didn't see him finished off. Here's Rek, though, onto Woogie. And like I said, if you don't get on them nice and quick here, Scars are going to want to try and play into you. They'll be the ones going aggressive. You're going to have to just try and push in here. Manage to get one, but it's immediately traded oh. back by Rec. He gets shut down though now, That's down but not out. out. Time. And the yeah, time is going to defy to eight seconds left to go. D plus Kier have no option but to try and find these right, kills. There's unlikely to be able to get oh that diffuser down, courted with one. It's effectively a 1v2. Rec, please, come on, buddy. We've gone way back. If that gets the Monty, you monster. must be joking! What? It's Almost fine with Shoy, but he still walks away and Yas is in a little bit of a dangerous spot. Loses out to a Shoy. In fact, it's a one-for-one -one trade. You will not complain about bringing down the Finker, though. Struggling to get that bakery wall oh, open. They've had that. to work right out to that right-hand side to avoid the Mute Jammer because they've simply got no utility to deal with that Mute Jammer. So now, D plus Kia having to work with sort of suboptimal breaches to be oh able to get God. through. Peon, second Nitro over the game. And this time, Peon Wreck was the first. Tayu picks up Woogie yeah, Man. They've only got rid of the four so far, and I really thought for a second then Wachoi was fancying himself a chance. Now they've seen him. They know that Wreck is here. He should be dead to rights. Tayu gets Woogie Man to open things up, and it just puts D plus Kia uh, even further towards a bad result here. Soldier, there, there go. you go. Fans, his man takes down Wreck with a headshot through the glass. Not the end of the world for Scars, though. Half of the round wasted, and Wreck only had about 15 health. Ones that get proceedingly higher, giving them more things to jump over. Was Shoy? He looks Sagoy up in the bat line, finds two for himself. It's exactly the same as we saw from Yas back in the first half. They have decimated them for the most part. Yas throwing them a little bit of a lifeline, but it's a 2v3 for D+. He's going to come. It's being watched. As soon as Soldier goes down, surely he'll come under fire. Yes, he does. But uh, manages boy. to turn around, get the kill on to Tyre.